How you doing, everybody? Thanks for drinks a lot. Back on the road again for a lap it up. And today's drink of choice. Something I haven't done, I haven't had in a while. And something that I haven't done in the program. RC Cola. It's Royal Cola Company. Me and my RC. <laughs> Royal Gallon Cola Company established in 1905. 12 fluid ounces. Very nice bright blue can and with the red lettering. Ah, 160 calories, 12 fat grams, zero sodium, 40 milligrams, total carbs, 43 grams, sugars, 42 grams. Let's see. Plano, Texas. Legacy Drive. Plano, Texas. Anyway. Uh, Dr. Pepper Seven Oak Company. That would, no. Let's give it a shot. Ah, yes. The cola nut. A lot of, uh, a lot of these cola companies, the, the cola nut. It's like you're thinking you're drinking Coca-Cola. Oh, it's, that's in there as well, but nobody really thinks about it until you try some of these off-brand colas that try to do their own natural thing, and you go, this tastes a bit odd. good. It's refreshing. Uh, I'm a Coke man myself, but there's something always kind of neat about trying a different cola every once in a while, mixing it up, you know, having a Pepsi instead of a Coke, or, you know, just uh, some of these uh, off-brand companies like, um, oh, it's Green Mountain in Austin. I think it's called Green Mountain. I'm not sure. It's something Mountain. That's Mountain. Um, I can't remember, but um, I, I went to this place and they had fountain drinks from this company that's mostly based, it's like it's based in Austin for one to understand. And uh, yeah, no, it's a, uh, they had the different flavors and the root beers and the cream sodas and the cola and the cherry cola. You know, I was like, this is really kind of neat. This own company does all these different things and it's not, it's a local thing. It's not bad. Yeah. I know. Anyway. But it's kind of neat to try some of these other ones. Like, uh, I think Pepsi did the, there's... 19-something. There. So, uh, I don't I don't, I think it's still going on. But they, they have their ginger soda. And, um... Uh, Colas. I don't know. There was, there was, like, I like the new things that the that the big companies try to do, as well as some of the smaller companies, you know. And uh, just the idea that some of these sodas started up at, at uh, pharmacies, you know, you're tweaking around your chemistry set and uh, trying to make sure that certain drinks can go down, you know. Whip up something. <coughs> Got some indigestion, you know. Make somebody burp. Have them drink a little bit. One, good to stay hydrated. There's water here as well, as well as a few other things. But whatever you can, like I said, ingest it, it makes you burp and it kind of lifts some of that indigestion up and it kind of gets your stomach kind of bubbling a little more so you're not hurting, not hurting but you're actually letting out some of the gas. Kind of neat. Well, I mean, you're taking in gas creation so that it helps you burp alleviates <clears throat> oh yeah thank you RC Cola I had, I had chicken strips I know it's gross to some people <clears throat> but I had chicken strips and anybody in the car with me would know I had chicken strips It's nice, good and refreshing. 
Um, gonna give it. Gonna give it a. I know the side if I'm being tough sometimes, and sometimes I'm being too easy. Um, Cause like this is, it's good. It's it's. Uh, I might even put it in the fridge, just to have something to drink. And these are probably a bit cheaper than my other sodas um, that I would normally have. And I honestly don't keep sodas in my fridge anymore. I don't. Um, tea. I have you know water, Gatorades, you know just something just for hydration and difference of taste and just water. Uh, fruit juices, you know, orange juice, apple juice kind of thing. But I mostly drink sodas out in the world. Uh, except for, like I said, on weekends, I might get like a liter and bring it back to the house, you know. So. Ah, down to the last drop, right? I could have left a little bit. Uh, but also, I'm used to drinking bigger cans, I guess. I don't know for this thing. <laughs> um, so I want to give it a four, but I'm thinking four might be a little too much. But then again, you know, because three on the five scale, three is already ab above middle. Four is getting there. You know, it's like, ooh, uh, I don't want to do three. I don't like doing halves most times on the low scale. I do, but I don't care for it as much. It's like, I got a small scale for a reason, a large scale for another reason. Um, it's, a, it's a regular cola. It's good. Uh, I'm going to give it a three. That's above average. Uh, on, the five, on the 10 scale, though, I really want to give this a seven. And I'm going to. Uh, which really should kind of give it a four. But... And the burping should be giving me a bit more on the scale. If I hadn't had the chicken, maybe. Anyway, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do that. Three to seven. Well, three to seven. Uh, Royal Cola Company, uh, you're good. I want to give you a little bit of a kavit because kavit, kavit, whatever. Uh, it's a good company. Uh, they've been around a pretty good long time, and they stick with their guns. On, I mean, that 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 soda anyway, not necessarily. Then we get Dr Pepper Seven Company. Dr Pepper's been around for a long time, and Royal Cola was is was its own thing, and I think it got bought out. I'm pretty sure. <coughs> but it's good, it's sweet, I like it, and I mean, you know, calorie count's not as bad as some other places, some other drinks. Um, thank you, Royal Cola Company, uh, you know, back in the day, now this is Dr. Pepper 7, so yeah, thanks guys, it's a good, good drink. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, this is me, Sir Drink Slot, wishing you health, wealth, and love with enough time and gusto to enjoy it all, down to the last drop. Leave comments below. Let me know what you what you think. If you've tried it, if you like Royal Cola, let me know. If you think I did a good rating, a bad rating, hey, that's that's what that's for. Uh, as well as this like button here somewhere, and then the subscribe button and, and hit the notification bell. I do put out videos every once in a while, occasionally, sometimes, maybe. And if you like them, hey, cool. Uh, I can't decide. The Royal Cola is doing this, or is it? Like I had I had a couple drinks beforehand. I, I had a writing day, so I I've had some sodas. Anyway, I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one.